Hey GS peers, it's Corey. You probably see me around the office uh, a bunch of times or signed up for cookies with Corey with me, but I uh, just wanted to give you a little bit of info about myself. Originally, I'm from a small town in upstate New York called Saratoga Springs, and I came to Georgetown in the fall of 2011 and uh, graduated in 2015. While I was here, I studied culture and politics in the School of Foreign Service and had an amazing experience during uh, during my four years, even though there were some, some bumps along the road. Um, some highlights were getting to, uh, to participate in a lot of the clubs and activities on campus. So there was DC Reads, DC Schools, Best Buddies, uh, Lecture Fund, and just a whole host of others that really felt like what made it a fulfilling experience for me. Also had the opportunities to study abroad in Ecuador and Ghana. So if you're considering studying abroad, come talk to me. I'd love talking about it. All of you know that some of you who have talked to me about that know that I can go on for, for hours about it. I had to pick a celebrity who I admire. For this year, I would have to go with Solange. Um, I, I loved her latest album, I loved the themes of it. I've bumped it a lot to get me through 2017 so far, so, so I love Solange. My favorite TV show is Atlanta. I'm thinking about watching it a second time because it was so good. I mean, Donald Glover just absolutely killed that show. Okay, so my favorite food would be anything that's Italian, although I'll really eat anything that's uh, in front of me. So my mom is Italian, so I grew up eating incredible food um, that, that was Italian, so anything that involves pasta, it's all me. I also have a huge sweet tooth, hence cookies with Cory. That's sort of tough, because you never... Because a part of me wants to donate a lot of it, and a part of me wants to just be selfish and take all of it. So one day, when I'm officially an adult, I want to be a lawyer, so I think a part of it I would donate to some organizations like the ACLU or Legal Defense Fund or anybody like that, and then if the rest of it I would probably spend traveling and just buying homes in different places so I didn't have an excuse to, to travel the world.